Don't want to whip out your computer every time you want to check to see if you're near a Wi-Fi hotspot so you can go and surf the web? Well, perhaps you want to pick up one of these, these small Wi-Fi keychain-esque devices, which offer you a Wi-Fi card inside that you press the button and it detects if you are in range, 200 meters to be exact, of a uh, free Wi-Fi um, router signal. And um, it's easy to use and it, um, it's an LED light indicated device. We've all seen one of these, and they are pretty much retailed across the nation on various stores, even in smaller stores, perhaps, in gas stations. I, I'm, I'm guessing. I haven't seen these, of course. But uh, they're about $30, and you can find them online as well. First of all, I would like to say that I think that these keychains are a little bit of a waste. When there's tons of feature phones and basic phones out there and devices that actually have screens and processors inside that don't even have Wi-Fi and computers and some laptops, cheaper ones don't even have Wi-Fi because it's kind of expensive. And here are these dead, um, standalone keychains that can only find you if there's a Wi-Fi network nearby and um, for so cheap, so it kind of makes me a little bit mad. But let's stay on the product itself. It's made entirely out of rubber. This is by Key Accessories, this particular model. It's made out of the soft touch material, which is grippy and easy to use. One of our biggest complaints is that the device uses two standalone uh, lithium iron cell batteries, which means that they don't last very long, and they only last about a year, and then they run out of power. And that's really bad for something like this because the cost can really add up fast. On the top, you find the, the, the indicator light for the Wi Fi antenna, and you press the detect button to find the detection. Now the first thing we have to say is that we don't like the device's actually LED indicating design. As you can see, there is a whole caliber of connection uh, button, a connection LED indicators. You might think that this is a signal strength and that is correct. Um, depending on how strong it is, it will light up green, but if you can't find a signal, it will also light up and blink red. This is pretty simple and you might think that. But actually, when you actually first turn it on, if you don't read the instructions, you'll be confused utterly because it's got this weird carousel of features. Like, if you don't keep on pressing the button for more than uh, 30 seconds, it will automatically start rescanning. And um, if it finds the same networks and it doesn't find any new networks, it will keep on blinking red or something like that. And then you, you'll just be standing there and looking at this device and you'll be thinking, why is it blinking red? I thought there was a signal here. So it's just a really confusing um, timer thing that you have to read the manual, which is included in the box, which we don't like head off. And um, another thing that we were kind of annoyed with is that, uh, yes, you don't want to power up your entire laptop just to see if there is Wi-Fi nearby, but um, let's be honest. If we have a mobile device like a phone or something else that has Wi-Fi already built in because we want to use that Wi-Fi to search the web, all phones with, or all laptops with Wi-Fi, they can power on. You can you just use that to basically search around. And it's not like, um, okay, I find a router nearby, and then I turn on my computer. Other than I can keep my computer turned on for the entire time, um, it, unless you're walking around, of course, to park for a long time. But we're talking about if we're in an airport or if we're in the mall, and we should maybe just use a mobile device, a phone, to find it instead of this. So the functionality is kind of repetitive, I guess is what I'm saying. So because of the functionality repetitiveness and the fact that the design isn't super well executed, this model in particular doesn't make that much sense for us to purchase. But perhaps there are other uses that you guys may find. Um, please read our full review on OSMDTX reviews. This is a key accessories Wi-Fi antenna receiver.